So hi guys, it's Carly here, and today we are finally going to do our melt crayon art. And actually we're going to show you how we actually make it, and we have a canvas, and we still do not know if we should do it long ways, or top, or whatever you want to call that. Um, but I think top, because there's not a lot of blues in these boxes, that's why we got two boxes, so we can like, just make them like, all over and then melt them and so what you need you need any kind of box of crayons it doesn't matter you don't have to have two as long as they can fit all on here and a hot glue gun or at least something to glue it down and a hair dryer to melt them i'm going to go through the boxes and i'm going to pick which ones i want are you doing blue i thought you were going to do like blues and pinks or yeah. blues and here, grays just pull out all the blues first okay I think there should be even other. like the dark blues, even yeah. like all these that are all the same, like indigo. See, like these too. Uh -huh. You want me to start getting out pinks because I passed them all. It's up to you. Yeah. Well, I guess we'll see how many we have when we line them up. I think the purples would look cute. Yeah. I don't like the pink. I like the purple. Look. Well, you could do if you're gonna do purple. We could blues, do blues, purples, pink and, and yeah. yeah. Then start getting all the purple out. Oh my goodness. So indecisive. There's a lot of crayons. We need a lot of crayons though. So now what I would do. Oh, I think I've been skipping the blue. So let's just go like this. Let's line them up. I forgot a blue. Like this and see if it goes all the way across. Is this a green? Yeah. I know this isn't the order that we're using. But we're just going to do that. Just want to see if they fit. They do. So perfect. So now that we know, whoops, that all those are going to fit. We're gonna Perfectly. Move, move that out of the way. And now you need to create what I your want. design okay now so we have all our crayons lined out how we want them and we decided that we're not gonna like have a pink mix with blue we're gonna have them all in order from blue, 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 blue purple pink and we made sure that none of the same crayons were next to each other so i'm gonna double check so next we're gonna hot glue them on Carly's nervous to do it. She wants to hate it. Yeah. Um, no, you can do it. So I'm gonna hold it up. Can I hold down the I'm cool hold button? It, do it this way. You ready? Don't just keep just the tip. Like, kind of aim for the black like, line. Like, all right. Kind of, yeah. scared and I'm just like I don't want to does this stuff come out and I'm just eh? and then my mom did probably most of it but then I did some at like the end in the beginning just a little bit and we were gonna melt more but we liked it how like all the white shows and what we were like really curious about is how like the purple got near the blue kind of well, just the splattered purple, the purple just like got over here and blue from like right here got all the way over there and it just kind of like went everywhere 
And so this is how it kind of really turned out. I really like it. So that's how we make our crayon art. If you do it different, that's cool, but we're just gonna show you how we melt crayons. So actually, I'm gonna hang this on my wall, but you can see in my room tour, which is going to be like maybe this week or maybe next week, it depends. I'll show you guys that when it's on my wall, my room tour. And that's it for today. Bye. Please subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Please thumbs up this video. If you guys have ever done this, take a picture of it, post it on Instagram, and tag Carly. We'd love to see the creations you come up with. I love, reason I love this kind of art is not one, like, not any two pieces look exactly the same. It always turns out different. I think that's really cool. So. So, bye.